Okay guys, the 2024 Greek Independence Day Parade. My opinion. So here's the thing. We went down there kind of early. Parking was a pain in the ass. They had blocked off a bunch of roads. They got to fix that next year. I hadn't been down there for like probably eight years to that parade. We used to go down there when I was a kid. It used to be hype. Last time we went down there, seven, eight years ago, was really, really terrible. But we all got together. We went down there. We stopped at a restaurant. I'm not going to say which restaurant because I'm going to do a review on them. The food was okay. Now, the for the parade, though, it got packed. It got packed. I don't know if you could see it from the videos. but Joined the revolt during the Greek War of Independence in response. Ottoman troops landed on the island and killed thousands. It was nice and awesome. Um... I'm going to give the parade an 8.1. Here's the thing, right? 8.1. I think they could have done a lot of stuff better. But I still think for how small it is, like that little one block radius, it was awesome. I liked it a lot. I would have liked some street vendors and, you know, more of those kind of things. You'd go try out some ethnic Greek food. They didn't have that. But again, it's because it's so small and it got so packed. I don't think you could have had anything like that. So again, that's my score on it. Let me know if there's any places or any fairs you think are going to be cool. I can go review those fairs, Polish fairs, whatever kind of fairs they are. It doesn't matter. I'll go review them. Stay safe. Stay cheeky, people.